It's been about a week and a half since I've been into the hive. I went through the top super and I had very little comb pulled at all. I had some, but very little. Uh, I went down into the super honey super below that and there was probably 50% of the comb pulled on and uh, probably about 30% was capped with honey. Then I went into the brood box. This is what I'm mainly interested in. And I was very concerned in hive number one because there is no brood. No, not, nowhere. I couldn't find any brood. I wasn't looking for a queen because that's too hard for me to find. And I did not see any supersedure cells. So I don't know if I need to requeen here or not. So I uh, had some pictures here. You can see from a distance what the um, brood uh, frame looks like and then up close and in this up close picture I couldn't tell whether this was pollen or nectar or or, or um, um, dead brood so I took a q-tip cut the uh, fuzzy part off and stuck it inside the center of these a cell, a couple of these cells, and it was just, it was powder, kind of dry powder. So if you can let me know what you think, um, whether I need a new queen or not, uh, they seem to be, everyone's kind of seems to be working, uh, but um, I don't see any, any new um, brood, I don't see any brood anywhere that I could find. Here's the brood box from uh, hive number two. And right in here, right there, you can see a bee coming out. I hope this is in focus. She's chewing her way through the honeycomb, working her way out. Uh, my concern is all these other empty holes here. I have seen some other larvae kind of sparsely set. I haven't seen any supersedure cells. But I'm not seeing brood like I, like I expected to see brood. We do have one girl here making her way out. I don't know if there's a. I'm gonna see if there's a if there's a macro. Okay, hopefully this is in focus, and you can see the girl there trying to get out. A couple others giving her encouragement and others walking on her head. So, I don't know how long it's going to take her to get out. I was just checking the hives. Don't see a queen, but that's not unusual. This could take her quite a while to get out. And here's a, the bees are, it's uh, probably about 10 o'clock in the morning. It's been about a week and a half since I've checked in here. So, anyway, so that's what it looks like to have a, a bee emerge. Working her way out, right there. You can see the very docile. They're just going about their work. Here's another frame. This is the brood box. This is where everybody is really working hard. Take care of the babies. Got my hive tool here. My smoker going. They are much docile, more docile with the smoker. This is what it looks like inside of a busy, productive beehive. Here's another brood frame. Uh, I just don't see a lot of brood in here. But maybe it's just because she's not laying eggs because there isn't a lot of flow and not a lot of need for bees. 
And then as you move up the frame to the uh, honey supers, there's less bees. Hope you enjoyed. This is LDS Prepper out.